Well, here we are in Kyoto, in uh, a Hodges living room with Rin. And your Conrad's pencil balance there is just balancing. Mm -hmm. Even if we go back here, put something in the background, it should just keep balancing. Even though this is right behind the camera. Mm -hmm. And you can see here that the, the pencil balancing and you can see the other pencil next to it. As long as it doesn't do, do too close. But if I move across, there, that made it fall because it looked like a pencil. Balancer is balancing the pencil fine, and you can see the, the output of the uh, balancer on this uh, integrated display here. And now what we can do is come in with a horizontal distractor up and down behind the pencil. And what you can see here in the display, you see it going up and down there, and you see the pencil ignoring it. You can pass up and down, even though the distractor is clearly in the field of view, and the pencil just ignores it. Now you can come in with a vertical distractor, and not if it's not too close to the pencil, if you just wiggle it back and forth, but not too close, so you can still see it on the display a little bit more. Yeah, wiggle it there. Just wiggle it. You can actually wiggle it quite fast. If it's not too close to the pencil, it just ignores it because the the uh, the tracker has this basin of attraction and stuff that's not in. Now pass directly quickly behind the pencil. You see it drop. You see that? Very quickly go behind it. Yeah, and that time the perturbation was too big and it did fall down.